This is a tutorial for iPicky.com on how to blur just part of a photo. You might want to blur a face or a car registration plate before uploading a photo to the internet. I'm going to upload a picture of a car to iPicky. I'll find the photo that I want to use, click on it, and then I can click on Open and the photo will appear in iPicky. So I'm going to scroll down to Blur on the sidebar menu and click on Blur and it has already blurred my photo a little bit. The strengthometer is on 3 so I'm going to use that strength bar to unblur the photo and then because I only want to blur just part of the photo I'm going to choose the Painter tool and just uh, to show you, if I choose uh, Effect and try to apply a blur effect to the photo, uh, nothing happens. Is it because uh, the strength bar isn't turned up enough? Well, if I use that, it blurs the whole photo. So the solution I found is to leave the whole photo blurred to the extent that I want, and then to click on Erase. And I use the maximum possible brush size and just move the effect mask to the left and unblur the whole photo using the Erase tool. And just uh, make sure that I've covered the whole photo with Erase and not missed a bit. And then I can reduce the brush size and click on Effect. Let's just have a look. That's perhaps still a little bit too large for brush size, so I'll reduce it a bit further. And now I can paint on the effect just on the place where I want it. So I can paint on a bit of blur over the registration plate. And when I'm happy with it, I'll click on Apply. So now all I have to do is save the photo, click on the save icon and because I want to keep the original photo I'm going to call this something slightly different, Beetle Edited and I tend to up the quality as well to 100% and then click on save photo. I'm happy to save it in store and go so I click on save and close the photo. So that was my solution to a problem I came across in using iPicky, which is generally a great tool, I think. Hope the video is helpful. Any comments, let me know.